went to a Limp Biscuit concert when I was in high school with Limp Biscuit, Clutch, and Seven Dust. Mm-hmm. And that sh- tour, I guess it was, was actually called Ladies' Night in Cambodia. <laughs> Joey, are you possessed? Oh my god! Hey, they say that I'm talking a whole lot of trash. I'm sitting there thinking like, who knew? I know that you've seen us on rappers react. They're talking about us on YouTube. Hollywood sticks, it look like I do magic. Maybe he's practicing voodoo. I'm hearing you're getting a lot of attention. Well, I'm here to say that we do to deliver the rubbish. I'm... What's going on, everybody? We're back with another segment of Rappers React. Smoked up. What up? I, I got trivia. Oh, what I got? Let's see here. Um, what? You better get this. Mm. What is a group of lions called? Uh, uh, a pride. Okay. All right. How many pairs of wings does a bee have? Two pairs. Good job. Okay. Um, how about this? What is the chemical symbol for copper? For copper. Hmm. It's not CO. No, it's not. That's what was it? Um, I, I got some periodic tables here, but that's not copper <laughs> no. either. Well, dang it, I can't remember what it was right offhand. It's uh, it's it's not D, is it? Uh, what is it? C U C. Oh, C. I thought it was something that didn't even start with C. Huh? C U. Huh? Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see here. Thanksgiving, Christmas, Easter, Labor Day, Memorial Day. These are all holidays. All right, take out the S. Okay. Out and in. Uh, name some Asian countries you can name for. Oh, is this Cambodia? Holiday in Cambodia? You got it, my friend. <laughs> guys, before we get started, please do us a big, big favor. Y'all, please hit that thumbs up button. And guys, please subscribe to the channel. And for God's sake, leave us a comment. And tell us what to react to next. That's how we get the ideas for these videos. It comes out right there from you. Right down in the comment section. And over on Patreon. And today... <clears throat> We have another wonderful suggestion from a couple of our wonderful Patreon members who go by the name of David, David Massey, Massey and DM Higgs. DM Higgs. DM yeah. Higgs, yes. Shout out to you, David Massey, and you, DM Higgs, because yeah. you two are two loyal Patreon members that sent us over a band that's got me and Smokey freaking out again because we <laughs> swear we've done the dead Kennedys. Yeah, I thought so. I really thought so, but. And when we were doing a lot of the early punk, the Sex Pistols and the Ramones and whatnot, this name came up a lot. And that's why I remember the, the title of that, because people were saying we need to do Dead Kennedy's Holiday in Cambodia. Oh, wow. So I remembered that name. I, sure. I, I even remember you describing the logo. Like you knew the logo. Of what yes, the yes. Dead Kennedy logo. Because was. I remember there was a kid that always wore one of those shirts when hey, we man, were in leave high John school. Crow alone, bro. Yeah, I don't think it was John Crow. <laughs> <laughs> dude, we didn't get, you done did enough to that dude. Leave that dude alone, man. Poor John, man. Ah, oh, man, that's my guy. I give him a high five. Shout out, John. Yeah. But no, uh, so there was a kid that wore it? Yeah, I can't remember who it was, but I specifically remember seeing that shirt. It was this red logo with, like, the, the straight letters. It was like an X, but it made the DK. Yeah. It was like the D and K coming off of that. What kind of noise did it make? Okay, gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. All yeah. right. Now try to whistle. <laughs> Man, why you always got to give me when I'm laughing? <laughs> All right. So, no. <laughs> I can't even do it when I'm laughing. <laughs> Listen, uh, um, what I wanted to say is you, you knew Cambodia so quickly. Yeah. You know this song? Yeah. No, no. I don't know the song. Like I said, I saw it in the suggestions. But I do remember when I, I've told this story a bunch of times about I went to a Limp Biscuit concert when I was in high school with Limp Biscuit, Clutch, and Seven Dust. Mm-hmm. And that sh- tour, I guess it was, was actually called Ladies' Night in Cambodia. Oh. I still remember it being on the ticket that said Ladies' Night in Cambodia. So I always thought that was kind of weird. Well, how did you get Cambodia when I said just name some Asian countries? And you because s- I said I've seen this suggestion in the comments. Oh, duh. I thought you, I, I thought you were talking about from the concert. Like, well, no, what no. Okay. No, I just remember them having that tour Tour, name i guess it was again terrible memory terrible (laughs) memory here so we both agree that this is 
punk. Yeah, yeah, early punk at that. Before Sex Pistols? I don't know that it's before. I believe this is an American punk band at that. Maybe oh. like a... I don't think they were a part of the original like New York scene, the punk scene out of New York, but huh. like they were West Coast or something like that. What, what about uh, Holiday in Cambodia? You know what I'm... I'm thinking something, but you already know. My, you always say my brain goes to the <laughs> the craziest places. So, oh, what you think you got? I mean, but you know, come on now. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Go well, ahead. There was a. There was, wasn't there like a genocide or something in Cambodia back in the day? Damn. And now I, my, I thought my brain went to the worst parts. <laughs> Yours just went gr- like, dang. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm sure it would come up if we Google what happened in Cambodia. But I remember something about that in history class about this big uh, tragic event happened in Cambodia. Smoke up! What up? Let's get into it. Let's do it. 1980. Yeah. Long after the to really really dig into this I do I think in a, I think I might want you to because he was t- first of all I don't know uh, 
I, I, I'm sorry I wouldn't call this punk. I, I wouldn't. You don't think? No, nah, not this song. It has a punk style, especially I mean, that early punk style of, you know, play fast. You know, here's one thing they say about punk, too, is that you don't have to be a good singer. You don't have to be a, a good guitar player. As long as you can hit those three chords and play them really <laughs> fast. <laughs> yeah. And then, po, yeah. pot. And you don't have to belt out the lyrics. You don't have to hit any certain notes. You know, just be a halfway decent singer. You know, sounds like punk rock. us being two rappers sound like if we wanted to transition over, that's that's the genre, <laughs> that's the we, genre need we need to join in. Yeah. <laughs> two punk rockers. Yeah. No, but do you mind, and Trash Talkers, I know y'all are probably going to leave it in the comments, but will you, because I think this song might be about the genocide yeah, that you're I talking think about. So. You know what? Because... Yes, he dropped the N-bomb, but I think he was referring to it as a... But God dang, this is in the 80s, though. Yeah. We need to bring up the lyrics. Can you bring up the lyrics while sure. I'm looking this up? I'm not saying that part on camera. No, I'm just I mean, saying... I, I want to hear the line that referred to it, though. Yes, I'm half black, so I can say it. If I wanted to, I would, dang it. Uh, what am I looking up? Uh, the lyrics to this song, Holiday in Cambodia. All right, so the Cambodian genocide was a systematic persecution and killing of Cambodian citizens by Khmer Rouge under the leadership of the Communist Party of Kampuchea, General Secretary Pol Pot. So it wasn't oh, food. Oh, that Pol Because he was talking about rice, and I was like, maybe it's a food. Wait, so General, he was a general? General Secretary. And he did the genocide? Yeah, it says, uh, by the Khmer Rouge under the leadership of the Communist Party of Kampuchea, General Secretary Pol Pot. Why would a band called the Dead Kennedys from America be oh, I've got an so idea. interested into that? I've got an idea. What you got? I think he's talking about, um... Like you, you're living your nice life here in America, and you, you're claiming you, you're claiming you yeah. have it so bad. Driving here. daddy's car and yeah, all that. Yeah. yeah, and you're complaining about how bad you have it. Well, take a holiday in Cambodia and see, see how, how bad you it like is. it. Yeah, was, was there like the part that you were talking about? Yeah, uh, playing ethnic jazz to parade your snaz on your five grand stereo. That, so you're, that's you're it. listening yes, to your yes, stereo, yes. bragging that you know how the feel cold and the slums got so much soul. Uh, so he was not using it derogatorily. No, he was saying he you was think using you it got in it. the context of you're complaining about people here when you really have it great. Yeah. yeah. They they say listen, you might be having a bad day, but trust me, someone's always having a better one. <laughs> exactly. I mean it can always get worse. Dude. Yeah. Yeah, go under that oppressive communist society where they're just killing off the people Man. their own people i'm wondering like to, it, trash talkers you know especially david massey and dm higgs do y'all know if like do they have a tie with cambodia i get what you're saying about you know oh we're we're yeah, driving in these nice just cars an example i would imagine you think they're just using it as like a like hey you, yeah. you got your five grand stereo yeah. Yeah. your dad's yeah. car you probably got a few a couple grand in the yeah. bank you yeah. know have a holiday in Cambodia. Come yeah. back and tell me how much you appreciate <laughs> yeah. these things. Exactly. I think that's what he's getting at. I would have to agree with you. David Massey and uh, DM Higgs, thank you so much for giving us some dead Kennedys because we needed it. And guys, if you want to support us, the best way to do that is through Patreon. It's only $5 a month. It helps us out so much with putting these videos out, sometimes multiple videos a day. And it also gives you a preview of the video that we do the day beforehand. And it puts your video on rotation. And David Massey and DM Higgs just gave you a promise an example as to why that is absolutely 100% guys let us know what's next by Dave Kennedy's down in the comment section and with that being said my name is Barringer Hollywood 6 bye I am Larry Smokey remember come and we are out. Bye -bye. I am out deuces my phone is going yeah. off hey, it didn't even silence it <laughs> bing I want to thank you guys for tuning in to another segment of Rappers React. If you guys want to see another artist that we covered, just click uh, right here. If you want to see the last video did, just click right over here. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of time with us today. Please hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already, and we'll see you on the next one. Deuces.